getting out there and voting. My biggest thing is hold that thought. We have sure, a we have oh, right the story. The new Council story. member, you're live. How are I'm you? Live? Yeah. That's what you're saying? Yeah, hold on a second. There. Folks, this is our my current Thank council member in Oakland, on. Lynette Gibson McElhaney. Um Lynette, um I, I gotta first of all, folks, if you live in Oakland, vote for her for District Three. Put her back in so she can continue okay. doing her great work. Uh, Lynette, how you doing? I'm doing well, Denny. Happy Sunday to you. Good afternoon, sir. Yeah, you got it. And we, in fairness to her, she didn't know I was on live. She was calling me back because she's <laughs> a good person. Okay, uh, but I want, but she's been a good friend. I want to put her out and basically. Uh, Give her a shout out. She's going to be back because this is this is the flow, folks. This is how it is to be at the convention. And I could have ran into her passing by and I would say, hey, you got a second? And she would say, oh, Zena, I would say, just 60 seconds. Okay. Right. right. <laughs> Wait a minute. Hey, while I have you here, uh, what, what do you think There's about the opportunity for us to connect mm -hmm. and to continue to do the good? The good work that we need to do. Absolutely, um, absolutely. Um, so I'm, I'm always delightful to be with Jenny uh, Fifty Media. I know that you will always have your face in the place um, at, at the conventions and continue to keep your your viewers and, and readers um, informed about what's happening in, in these really important places um, where the parties gather. So um, I'm happy and really high to be on. on on the call with you now. So, what are we talking about? Well, we've got uh, my 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 group, my posse, my friends, my family, my corporate family. We've got Eric Wilson in Florida, Vinny Laspinoso in uh, New York, Bill Carroll in New York, and myself here, technically in Oakland. So, uh, we're doing a roundtable talk, our preview of our coverage for the DNC 2020, and uh, that's what we're doing. And we're going to be doing this each and every night, actually. Uh, uh, from well, now until tomorrow and everything else. And Vinny is our designated blogger. Uh, is going to be posting. And uh, we've got a we've got a great group here, you know. Uh, hey, everybody, say hi to Councilmember wow. McElhaney. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening, How, are you? How are you doing oh, this fine okay. evening? I'm actually in Chicago, Vinny. Yeah, so uh, that's hmm. that's the group. Actually, it's one part of our, our great group. And uh, yeah, you know, we've been building a great thing here. I'm mean, really, really, really happy for our, our nationwide group. We've got a uh, guy in London, too. And, um, you know, but we're looking for more vloggers. So if you've got anybody in mind, send them my way. Hey, council member. Uh, good. I, I have logged into uh, YouTube. I had a feeling I was good to see you. Hello, gentlemen. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Thank you. And hey, <laughs> what, what are your thoughts about Kamala Harris as the first black female vice presidential uh, nominee to be, you know. Hey, Vinny. Yes, ma'am. I'm going to invite all of you. Cover your ears. Cover your ears. I'm warning you. Kamala <laughs> 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 is going to the White House. <laughs> <laughs> I warned you. No, that's I warned great. You. I don't know. I, I don't know about you guys. I think she sounds excited. <laughs> I think so. I think she's uh, very. I think she's very elated by that. Oh, she should be. And this is a, this is a massive win for yeah, not just women but African Americans as a whole. She's saying, "Hold on, she's saying so." Go ahead, go ahead, Council Member. Sorry, and ahead. Southeast Asians. That too. Go ahead, go ahead, Council Member. Sorry, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, Council Member. Sorry. So, 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 so when the 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 DMC was in San Francisco last summer. Those of us who were volunteering on, on Kamala's campaign, we, we, we went over there. We went over there and we um, cut up when she gave her speech. And I, I made up the chant that was, be smart, be strong. With Kamala, you can't go wrong. Be smart, be She's strong. strong. With, With Kamala, Kamala you, you can't, can't go, go wrong. wrong. She's smart. I like that. I like Let's, it, too. Everybody, yeah. one, two, three. She's, she's smart. smart. She's, she's strong. strong. With Kamala, you, you can't, can't go wrong. wrong. Smart, right. strong. With Kamala, you can't go wrong. For Kamala to be at the top of the ticket, but uh, <laughs> nobody 
himself and this country a great service by bringing this incredible, sharp, strong uh, to the ticket. And I, I just couldn't be um, more energized um, to move forward into November. Well, council member, I know you've got a lot on your plate, and I just want to thank you so very much for blessing us with your presence. Um, and uh, we'll be back. We'll have you on again before the convention's out. And I'm going to firm that up with you. All right. You all have a beautiful day. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Good luck, at Congress, Congresswoman Member uh, McEnany. Yes, thank you so much. This, is a, this, this, this season right now will really demonstrate the strength of the black voter. Yep. And, and not just African Americans, but the Pan African diaspora, uh, the Caribbean is going to show up and show out. Black Hispanics are coming in full effect. This is a season um, right now where we're going to really have a sea change in American politics. Um, not, not only because Kamala is on the ticket, but because the issues that are in front of us are laid bare, the failed thinking and rotten policies that have been allowed to, to, to rot the purpose of our democracy. So COVID-19 did not create racial disparity, it exposed it. Um, the, the economic vulnerability of working families that are now facing foreclosure and eviction and record numbers um, shows that we have been, you know, dealing with an economy that is in a lot of smoke and mirrors with a over concentration in the top one quarter, or one half of one percent. Um, and so right now, we are, we are at a key change moment where we can advance an agenda that is a democracy for the many, not the few, a capitalism that can be conscientious and deliver a social safety net that keeps our most vulnerable families from drowning while destroying our middle class, and having a shared prosperity where the wealthy are called into their two places of saving to do their fair share to keep America strong. I'm excited about the convention. I'm so glad that some real folks um, close to the communities like the, the four of you here are going to be there to capture our story. But let us get excited. Let us push past um, everything that would keep us um, discouraged. Let us not fall into the trap of looking for our politicians to be God. They are people looking for a job where they're paid on a W-2. So let's get rid of everything else. Say this is a work, and I'm so grateful that Joe decided to run and to yield himself in service, and that he had the wisdom to use his awesome privilege as a white man to make sure that we are crashing glass ceilings. So go Biden Harris 2020. I'm looking forward to an incredible convention and um, to this being a sea change year. Thank you all for this time. Talk hey, to you thank later. Thank you, Council Bye. Member. God bless you. See ya. Good luck, Council Member. Yes, thank you. So that's how it is, folks. See, that's how uh, that's how it works at a convention yep. in real life. I mean, we're just saying when we were there physically, and that's how I wanted to work this time. So you don't quite know who's going to pop in and out and make comments. Uh, and yet, hey, uh, we are talking about the. Democratic Party and and uh, what and it brings us all together to really talk about positive change, you know.